Coming back to the banking example we used earlier. Suppose, a hacker, is able to gain access to the code and tries to deposit an invalid amount into your account. Usually variables in the class are set as private and they can only be accessed via corresponding methods. So such access is not allowed. Next he tries to use the deposit method to carry out his operation. But the method implementation has checked for negative values and throws an error. Thus, you never expose your data to an external party and which makes your application secure. The entire code can thought of as a capsule and you can only communicate to it via messages. Hence the name encapsulation.